it's been 24 hours since I applied the navel jelly today I removed it it's still wet which is a good thing so it did not dry it's a uh, it's cold anyway and uh, now it's time to neutralize the acid so I have here carbonate sodium the one uh, bicarbonate you have in the in the house mix it with a little bit of water and a sponge I'm gonna squeeze like that and try and wipe it carefully multiple times to make sure that the acid has been neutralized has been removed so I mix the epoxy the GB weld and I apply them where I mark it both ends I also have in the rims on the outside here also I put inside some so I did what's called double buttering and now I'm gonna apply it I won't be able to film that so all right so I finished and it's nice and messy which should be messy I also filled the gaps here there was some gaps here I also filled it with GB weld you can see here that I did not do a good job with the uh, pop-up rivets but it's still holding it's still tight I'm gonna come tomorrow I'm, I don't wanna mess with it I'm I'm afraid if I try with the rivet riveting gun that this will get loose so tomorrow when it's completely completely cure I will try to snap this off or try to reuse the uh, the gun but I'm not gonna do anything. I'm done for the day and I'll just wait till it's completely cured. Tomorrow is another day. After, of course, after cures, I'm gonna go the next level, next step, not level, next step will be with like sand the blade, roughing it, roughing the surface. Yes, the GB well can be roughened by blasting or abrasive. I'll figure this out. Then I will apply some primer, uh, bondo maybe, but has to be painted at the end. Please subscribe, share, and like the videos. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you and have a good day.